This click rotates a tiny staircase, you push the top, click, the tip appears and stays, push again, click, it vanishes, the switch is a circle you can't see, inside it's not just a spring, it's a two-state mechanism, button, cam sleeve, pawl, spring, tip, the cam sleeve has ramps cut like a spiral staircase, a little pawl rides those ramps, the spring is always trying to pull the tip back in, first press, finding a ledge, your thumb shoves the button, that twist you don't notice? It rotates the cam sleeve a few degrees. The pawl climbs a ramp. It drops into a ledge. It locks the nose forward. The spring stays stretched, but the ledge is the boss. That's why the tip stays out. Why it doesn't drift. The pawl sits just past a peak, over center. Tiny bumps can't shove it back over the hill. Your bag can jostle it all day. The ledge holds the load. It's not the spring deciding. It's the ledge. Second press. Release. Press again and the sleeve rotates to the next step. Now the pawl lines up with a valley. The spring finally wins. Yanks the tip inward. The pawl lands on a home ledge ready for the next cycle the sound you hear that crisp click is the pal snapping over a ramp and slapping a ledge bright plastic sharper click metal parts softer muted click variations some pens split the pal into two fingers so each step feels smoother others use a cam ring with four positions to lighten the press and spread the wear a small detent bump can add a bonus double click feel if a pen feels mushy the ramps are shallow or the pawl edges are worn Quick map, cam ramps, pole drops to ledge, over center hold, next step equals release, click equals pole snap, every press is a tiny turn, a short climb, and a clean fall into place, a staircase for your thumb, if this scratch that curiosity itch, I've got more small mechanisms decoded next. Follow, for the good clicks.